We're now going to go through the process of creating a texture using Photoshop's filters. Now the first thing is to just show the area. If I hold down the Alt key with the magnifying glass, you can see the area that we're going to fill in with a texture. Let's zoom back out here. And so this is the area and going to simply go and use our magic wand tool which will select the white that is bounded by these edges. So this is the area where ground cover will be filled in. Now we're going to take this green color and fill it in and so we simply come to the paint bucket tool and click and that fills in with a green. Now we're going to give this a texture. First we're going to texturize this. Come under Texture, Texturizer, and we're going to move to the area and you can see in this preview and let's come and change this texture to sandstone. You can play around with the scaling. You can see how the texture, the scaling of the texture changes and the relative relief of that texture. And you can also set the direction from which the light is coming to cast a shadow on that. So that we're going to have our light coming from the top right and hit OK. Now, this creates an OK texture for our ground cover, but doesn't look too realistic. So what we're going to do is come and select one of our artistic filters and use dry brush. Again, come over and you can see now with this dry brush, you get something that looks a little bit more like the plan view of a ground cover. So we can play around with the brush and the relative texture of that and hit OK. And voila, we now have a ground cover texture within this area of our drawing. Have fun with that and just keep playing around.